fire and ice. Devon woke up to a late night, early morning. Devon, can we go back to the dream? I'm still tired, said Rascal sleepily. Let's go outside. Devon got up and Rascal fell off the bed. Stood up, then walked into a wall. This way, Rascal. Ow. Devon opened the slide door and stepped out, and Rascal fell out. He started to whimper. Devon picked him up and held him. The fall had caused him to get it to get scratched. Devon put his hand on it, then took it off. The scratch was slowly disappearing. Devon's eyes opened wide. Rascal, are you my friend? Of course. Rascal jumped on his head. You're the reason I exist. I love you, Devon. Thanks. Devon then heard creaking from above. Devon looked up. Spark was flying above. Oh, hi, Devon. Rascal, said Spark, hovering down into Devon's arm. Suddenly, Rascal jumped down and was hearing something. He ran to a square-shaped hole in the ground. Devon and Spark joined his concern. They heard voices. Hey, can you blast out that hole? Sure. A ignited fire was headed towards the surface. Rascal was pulled out of its way. The lid to the ground popped out, and two mice jumped out. Oh, sorry to scare you guys, said the female mouse with an ice with ice scales. Hello, said the mouse. A male mouse with spikes on his back all the way to his tail. My name is Yimi, and this is my best friend Nibble. Can we stay with you guys? Sure, said Devon in relief. And totally forgot why he said sure. <laughs>